Shan, I don't assume you've ever been a farmer, right? Because you no. live in the city. But have you ever planted some plants and had fun with them? No, Not I haven't. Really? Well, it's, it's a lot of fun. And most people, when you think of planting plants, think about seeds. From but the they're store. sort of expensive when you buy it in that form. All you have to do is kind of keep an eye on what you eat. Watermelon? Oh, you can grow seeds from that. Right, yeah. So when you're finished eating, why well, you save the seeds and plant them. Uh, after all, you can buy bird seed at the grocery store. You can grow from grow and from sure, bird they're, seed? they're bird seeds. You know, they, they don't go into birds, but they go <laughs> into little plants. Cherries, uh, what's that stuff? Garlic? Um, yeah, that'll grow into a beautiful plant. And you can actually plant things from that are really not seeds. Cut off the bottom of the carrot and the top of the carrot and plant it and whatnot, and it'll grow. In fact, uh, you can go to the library and get a lot of help on how to grow things, but it so happens I have written a book. Can you Mr. get that book in the library? Yeah, a lot of li libraries carry them, but I'm going to give you this one. It's called Mr. Wizard's Experiments for Young Scientists. And here's a whole chapter on grocery farming. Oh, neat. Grocery well, farm. With a lot of instructions on how to grow everything. So here, take the book, okay? And I'm going to give you all these seeds, and you bring them back when they're all grown, okay? Sounds good. This should be fun. Okay, and lots of luck. Thanks very much. Okay. Bye. I think my favorite out of all these was the garlic. This, this yeah. one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why? I think it was the most fun to watch grow. Did it grow easily? Yeah, and really fast, too. Mm -hmm. Well, it's a bulb, you know, like an onion, so mm -hmm. there's a lot of energy there to grow rather quickly. Yeah. yeah. I see you have holes in the bottom like you're yeah, supposed to. Yeah, I punched holes in the bottom um, to let the water drain out. Mm -hmm. I read that in the book that, Very good. that Thank you gave you. me. Okay. Um, and this one here is tomatoes. Oh, how do you know? It doesn't say tomato on it. Well, it has a number on it. I use the number system. Okay, that you... and it's number? Number nine. Okay. That was, that was one of the systems that, right. that you mentioned yeah. in the book. Did that come from a package? The tomatoes? No, it came actually from right a from the tomato. A real tomato seeds. Okay, yeah. very good. Well, you'll have... Nice crop of tomatoes. Yeah. How about this one? That is bird seed. I was really surprised that that grew. Why? I don't know. It just is, bird seed, after it. all, <laughs> seeds, right? You probably don't know what the plant is because it doesn't say on the outside. No, it looks like some sort of grass, but yeah. it's I don't probably know. millet, which is a very favorite sort of thing that they put in bird seed. Mm -hmm. But you have to wait till it grows up a little more, and then you'll have yeah. to see if you can identify it. Very good. This one? Um, that is watermelon. Ah. From that a one, watermelon? Yeah, right from the watermelon. Good. That one, when I transplanted it from, I, first of all, it was in a little styrofoam cup. Then I put it into the bigger one. And when, it, when I transplanted it, it drooped, and it never really came back well, up again. Well, it looks like it's reaching for the light. When it, when it gets tall and skinny like that, it usually means that it, w it wasn't getting enough light because the, these first see, the first leaves up here begin to manufacture food, so they need mm -hmm. light. So it's been later on, for, the, for quite a while. Right, so. we haven't had very much sun. So later on, you're going to transplant it outside. Yeah, into the well, garden. It'll probably be okay then. Yeah. This one did wet well. Yeah, that's uh, cantaloupe, right from the cantaloupe. Ah, good. Yeah. So it is really a a grocery store garden, right? Yeah. From foods. Then I see you have holes in the bottom of this too. Right? Yeah. This is really done well. Yeah, that's beans. They're out of a package. Okay, well you're forgiven. You can <laughs> grow one out of the package. Pretty soon you're going to have a little flower, I think, right there. Yeah. And then pretty soon out will come a bean, and then another one and another one. And are you going to transplant this too? Yeah, right into the garden. Okay, well then eventually you will have produce from your grocery garden, and I'd like to share some of it with you. Can I? Sounds good. Very good. You, congratulations, Shan. You did real well. Thanks.